40 days meditation on 14 stations of the cross of 16 scriptures. Jeremiah 24 6 says, I will watch over them and bring them back to this land. I will build them up and not tear them down. I will plant them and not pull them up. First station. Jesus is condemned to death. John 3 16 says, For God loved the world so much that he gave his only son so that everyone who believes in him may not die but have eternal life. Second station. Jesus is made to bear his cross. Luke 9.23 says, And he said to them all, If you want to come with me, you must forget yourself. Take up your cross every day and follow me. Third station. Jesus falls for the first time. Philippians 2.6-8 he always had the nature of God, but he did not think that by force he should try to remain equal with God. Instead of this, of his own free will, he gave up all he had and took the nature of a servant. He became like a human being and appeared in human likeness. He was humble and walked the path of obedience all the way to death. His death on the cross. Fourth station, Jesus meets his mother. Luke 2, 34-35 Simeon blessed them and said to Mary, his mother, This child is chosen by God for the destruction and the salvation of many in Israel. He will be a sign from God, which many people will speak against, and so reveal their secret thoughts and sorrow like a sharp sword will break your own heart. Fifth station, Simon helps Jesus carry his cross. Matthew 27, 30 to 32 says, They spat on him and took the stick and hit him over the head. When they had finished making fun of him, they took the robe off and put his own clothes back on. Then they led him out to crucify him. As they were going out, they met a man from Cyrene named Simon, and the soldiers forced him to carry Jesus' cross. Sixth Station Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. John 14, 9 says, If you ask me for anything in my name, I will do it. Seventh Station Jesus falls a second time. Hebrews 4, 15 A high priest is not one who cannot feel sympathy for our weaknesses. On the contrary, we have a high priest who was tempted in every way that we are, but did not sin. Let us have confidence, then, and approach God's throne. Where there is grace, there we will receive mercy and find grace to help us just when we need it. Eighth Station Jesus meets the women of Jerusalem Luke 23, 27-31 A large crowd of people followed him. Among them were some women who were weeping and wailing for him. Jesus turned to them and said, Women of Jerusalem, don't cry for me, but for yourselves and your children. For the days are coming when people will say, How lucky are the women who never had children, who never bore babies, who never nursed them. That will be the time when people will say to the mountains, Fall on us and to the hills, hide us. Ninth Station Jesus falls the third time. Luke 14, 11 says, For those who make themselves great will be humbled, and those who humble themselves will be made great. 10th station, Jesus is stripped off his garments. Luke 14, 33 says, In the same way, concluded Jesus, None of you can be my disciple unless you give up everything you have. 
11th station Jesus is nailed to the cross John 19:17 to 18 says He went out carrying his cross and came to the place of the skull as it is called in Hebrew it is called Golgotha There they crucified him and they also crucified two other men one on each side with Jesus between them 12th station Jesus dies on the cross John 19:28 to 30 Jesus knew that by now everything had been completed and in order to make the scripture come true he said I am thirsty A bowl was there full of cheap wine so a sponge was soaked in the wine put on a stalk of hyssop and lifted it up to his lips Jesus drank the wine and said it is finished then he bowed his head and gave up his spirit 13th station Jesus is taken down from the cross Mark 15:42 to 45 It was toward evening when Joseph of Arimathea arrived. He was a respected member of the council who was waiting for the coming of the kingdom of God. It was preparation day, that is the day before the Sabbath. So Joseph went boldly into the presence of Pilate and asked him for the body of Jesus. Pilate was surprised to hear that Jesus was already dead. He called the army officer and asked him if Jesus had been dead a long time. After hearing the officer's report, Pilate told Joseph he could have the body. 14th station. Jesus is laid in his tomb. Luke 23:53 to 56. Then he took the body down, wrapped it in a linen sheet. and placed it in a tomb which had been dug out of solid rock which had never been used it was friday and the sabbath was about to begin the women who had followed jesus from galilee went with joseph and saw the tomb and how jesus body was placed in it then they went back home and prepared the spices and perfumes for the body on the sabbath they rested as the law commanded James 4:10 says humble yourselves before the lord and he will lift you up amen